Well, it's great to see you again. So welcome back to the UK for your first football game yeah. since leaving. How do you yeah. feel to be here? Um, good, good. Um, it's nice to be back. Um, it's been a while since I've been here as well. So yeah, I'm, I'm happy to be back. Look, new city. I know you're wearing a baseball cap, but the <laughs> hair's gone. Was it like new city, new country, new yeah. look? Yeah, yeah. I've, in my head, I just thought, yeah, I'm just, I just went to try something totally different so yeah when after I got married I cut my hair and yeah just totally different insight on life and everything. So is life good? How's the transition been from Crystal Palace to Istanbul? Um, it's yeah it's totally different obviously just from being in an area that's just local and I just know everyone to just a whole different country different language different culture me personally, I just wanted to try something totally different that I've never experienced before. And so far it's going well. Obviously, you've had, you have to adapt to a few things, but like, I don't really mind really. And most of the time, the, the, the weather's been nice as well. So that's <laughs> helped. So yeah, it's been, it's been a smooth transition for me. Any Turkish going on? Are, um, you, are you trying? Probably, probably... A, f a few words, yeah. um, to seculars, thank you. So yeah, I know a few. I'm I know impressed. A few. Yeah. I'm impressed. But look, you were a club legend at Crystal Palace. You've got murals in South London. Why was it the right time to move? And was that a difficult decision in the end? It was, but at the same time, I just thought, I think it's, it's the time for me to move on now. Because obviously at the same time, there was like, there's the younger players coming through and I feel like it gives them an opportunity to shine as well. And I feel like I've been, I've been at Crystal Palace for a long time. I feel like I, I've accomplished everything I could there and it's always been my dream to, to play Champions League football. Mm. So to be able to get that opportunity, finally, is something I couldn't turn down. So I had to wave goodbye to to Crystal Palace, obviously the club I've loved for many years. I still love them, but it's just a new adventure for me. And look, you've got your first minutes in the yeah, Champions yeah. League. How was that feeling? Was it? Did it feel like a lifetime ambition ticked off? Honestly, it, it did. Because, like when I when I when I went onto the pitch, it's just like this is this is stuff I've literally dreamt about. You mm. know, like it's it's hard to put into words because I've I've dreamed about. It. I've sat down and watched so many games. It's like like that's what I want to be at and to be able to come on in um, in the game and, and assist as well so yeah it was it, it was just an amazing feeling yeah was it two appearances an assist it's not a bad start yeah. to life not yeah, a bad start to life. yeah it's, it's, it's going well so far and you've got your first goal in the league as yeah. well which must have been a brilliant feeling just to get underway yeah um, obviously when I came out first obviously um when I left Palace, I had the injury, and then when when I got to Galatasaray, I, st I started with the team, and then I had a little setback again. So it was a bit annoying, but obviously it was nice to to obviously get a couple minutes with the team, and then that was my first start and managed to score a goal. So yeah, it's just like after all the hard work has paid off. Do you feel like you're integrating well and understanding sort of the Galatasaray way and the team and what's expected of you, what's being asked of you? Um, I think the main thing is with with the team anyway. What what I figured anyway is just um, work hard for the team really, and that's something that I'm willing to do. I feel like everyone in the team, as long as you work hard for each other your talent will shine through eventually. Is it different? Is it very different, the Premier League football to Turkish League football? Um, I feel like it is very end-to-end -end in Turkish football. So that's one thing that I'm, I'm definitely getting used to as well. Like um, the last game, I was very tired. So it's something that I definitely need to get used to. And get my, as I'm, obviously, as I have more minutes, my fitness is going to get better and better. But yeah. The one, I've, the one thing I've noticed is just non-stop. That's the biggest difference I've noticed. Do you still keep a track of Premier League football or teams or Palace um, while you're away? Yeah, I do. Like in the, in the evenings, obviously, 
I just go on YouTube and I mm -hmm. go on a pre I, I follow the Premier League on my YouTube. So I, I just watch all the games back. Yeah. So yeah, see, I, I can't I can't leave and just stop totally. So yeah, I still I still tend to watch games. It's still in your blood. It's yeah, hundred percent. There's no one I'm just going to leave and not. And look, a tie against Manchester United in the Champions League. Yeah. Yeah, How do you crazy. feel when that came through? Yeah, I, I, yeah. I, it's just it's so random that it would be Man United that I I end up playing against in the Champions League. But yeah, it's it's a beautiful stadium. Obviously, we're happy to be here, and we're just looking forward to it tomorrow night. Do you sense it's a real opportunity in actual fact because you've started great in the league? And yeah. obviously, United start hasn't been the best to their campaign this season. From the outside, it would look like, yeah, this would be the best chance if we're going to beat United. But at the same time, in football, you never know what could happen because from the last game they lost against Crystal Palace on the weekend, yeah. they could be, they could come out and blast us away with because obviously they need to to come out and um, with a very big performance after the loss. So, yeah, you never know, but... We're definitely just looking forward to the game.